Hospitals in Riverside County are in a dire situation, facing an overflow of patients with staffing and space for them dwindling. The situation is so serious now, the National Guard is in Riverside to help. More now from NBC4's Christine Kim. We've been hearing how surging cases could impact not only coronavirus patients, but others with emergencies. And a Riverside County woman says she saw firsthand the emergency room packed, the sheer volume of patients and staff exhausted. I um, was extremely scared. I had an infection that can quickly turn into septus. So my automatic reaction was thinking, I... If I can't get back there and get the medical care that I need, I'm never going to see my kids again. In Christina Dewani's two visits to Temecula Valley Hospital starting on December 23rd, she saw why some hospitals say they're now in crisis. The second visit into the ER when I was in the hall and being treated in the hall, that is when I had to go into the restroom to have my catheter removed while in the restroom because there was no rooms available. The hospital isn't commenting on the situation, but it's what many throughout the region have warned us about. Riverside Community Hospital converted its cafeteria to handle the surge of patients waiting in line in the ER for hospital beds to open up. The state deployed nine members of its National Guard Medical Corps to help in the ER, but they're still short-staffed. Our caregivers are exhausted. Uh, they're putting in extra shifts. They're caring for 214 COVID-19 patients, and there's no more room in the ICU. This is the worst we've seen. The county-run hospital Riverside University Health System is activating its surge plans. That's also happening at the Riverside and Moreno Kaiser Permanente Medical Centers, where they even converted conference rooms into patient care areas, postponed non-emergent surgeries, and redeployed staff. And while you may experience a wait, hospitals say if you need medical care, don't hesitate to come to the ER. But because of the COVID surge, Dewani sees why we all need to help slow the spread. This is serious. It's extremely scary. You're not going to be able to get the care that you need like how you did in the past. In Riverside, Christine Kim, NBC4 News.